Welcome to the Argonaut Weekly. We are joined now by UWF assistant volleyball coach Patricia Gandolfo. Coach, four games this past weekend. You won three out of four. Are you focusing more on the three wins, or is it kind of that one loss sitting with you? Well, yeah, we can just ignore that we lost. Um, even though it was number two in the nation, we can't just be happy with our performance on Saturday. But we are definitely happy with the three and one. We wish we could go four and zero, but we we're gonna keep drilling the girls this weekend. Try to go make it better. All right now, a tough loss to number two Tampa. Were you, you guys were on a 12-game winning streak coming into that match. Was that kind of like a measuring stick for you? And how do you think you, you fared against a good team like that? It was like Melissa always says, it was a little piece of humble pie for us. We, we were, it was kind of disappointing our performance, but we, uh, Tampa always, she always going to bring their A game. And we knew they were going to play very well against everybody that they play, and especially against us. So was we we could have done better we will work on that <laughs> all right now we're back to conference this week with UNO followed by Christian Brothers and North Al kind of a no they're all really tough games but kind of a special game for you guys against North Al with the packet pink match tell uh, tell us a little about what's going on and how people can get involved with that uh, now we uh, we have a volleyball team on the website for uh, the breast cancer awareness we've been trying to send out emails and we're going to have a silent auction also so people can help us and uh, help um, the fight against breast cancer. Just come to the match, come support our team and, and wear your pink. <laughs> All right, the UWF volleyball team will be back in action taking on UNO on Tuesday followed by Christian Brothers and North Al this weekend. You can find it all at GoArgos.com.